Shalom, you must be new to Nazareth. Welcome, welcome. Show your passport, suit. I see here, Gadiel, that you are the family of David. It is Caesar's decree that all must return to their own city to register for a census and pay a tax. You and your family will leave at once for Bethlehem. You and your family may go, but beware. There are beggars and thieves along the byway. Barabbas is still at large. Greetings and peace, friends. I am Casper. My companions are Melchior and Balthazar. We are magi from the east. Wondrous thing. Wonder what? Fear not. We'll be home. Hold your tongue! I will not warn you again! Throw him in prison! What's going on here? Who's responsible for this disturbance? You? No, Centurion. This man has insulted me for doing my duty to Rome. Take him away from me. Welcome to our humble village. I do hope that your journey was safe, for these are indeed perilous times in which we live. But there have been rumors, rumors regarding the prophecies of Isaiah. But for now, allow your family to look about the village, shop, warm yourselves by our fire, partake of all that Bethlehem, the city of David, has to offer. Samuel, do we have room for another family? A very large family. Anna, you know I'm trying to finish up my taxes. No! But, but, there's but, no but, room at the end! But, but we've come such a long way, we've no place to stay! We have no room. Joseph, is that you? Daddy, oh, so long. So long. Let this cross be a silent reminder that the Jesus who was born in the stable is the same Jesus who died on the cross for our sins. The Jesus who was resurrected from the dead for forgiveness of our sins so that we could live in the love and power of God with abundant joy.